Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. So, uh, we're doing alright here. Um, we're currently at war with Cumania, because they went to war with us, and so I've counter-warred them, if I remember correctly. Uh, yeah, we're, we're going for this little piece of land here. We're going to take it, no problem, I think. Let's just get going. Still have a little too much stuff in my domain, uh, but don't really have any way to solve that problem as of now, so we're just going to have too much stuff in our domain for a little bit. It is what it is. I'm going to just suck it up and get and live with it. Alright, what do we got here? 1,500 minutes can take us a while to siege that down, but it will happen. Hey, yeah, he's doing his little happy dance over here again. Um, I forget. One of these is better than the other. I want to do the intense study of the book. I think this will get me scholar, which will give me plus two learning or something like that. Yep. Um, not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, how does that put me on the uh, learning set? What I need is intrigue. That's what I need. I need me some intrigue. And somebody just died of the Great Pox. Why did it just tell me this guy died of the Great Pox? That was a weird one. That that pop-up came up here and was like, You've died of the Great Pops. Pox. Apparently my heir is unmarried. My aunt. My aunt is still my heir. I have two sons. Didn't I nominate my sons? I did not. That is something that I should deal with. I believe I, his name is William. One of my son's name is William. No, I want Robert. Robert the Bruce, that's what his name was. <laughs> I totally forgot about that. There we go. I've nominated my son. Everybody should switch sides here. Um, Robert the Bruce was curious about visitors. <laughs> oh, God. Um, he's going to gain one diplomacy and become gregarious. That is really good. He's 10, I gotta keep track of that. Robert the Bruce was worried about or curious about visitors. <laughs> oh, that's gonna make me giggle every time, guys. I'm sorry, that is gonna make me laugh every time. Oh, that's pretty good. Anyway, I wish I could rush down the siege, but I can't, and I'm paused, I didn't even realize that. Oh, dumb of me. Yep, everyone's switching, switching to me. There we go. And that actually should give me a little bit of a bonus, because I'm guessing I was having, uh, a negative modifier for having a female heir, and now, um, a lot of pop-ups just came out there. Now it's probably not happening, out of curiosity. Yeah, I even have more supporters than I did before, and it's probably because my heir was female, so people disliked me so much, so they didn't want to select her as my heir. It's a little bit of a circular reasoning there, isn't it? Anyways, we're going to win this siege, and then we'll come crush this army here. We have two separate uprisings going on right now and Karakum has converted which one was Karakum? is that down here it is beautiful let's get um Dihistan to convert next the faster we get these provinces to convert the less goddamn revolts I'm gonna have to fight don't we all agree we all agree okay cool let's go up to speed four because I'm tired of uh, waiting for this stupid siege to end I want to win I want to win now Good, they're going home. They're going home to try to break my old siege on Turgay. Which is fine because we'll win our siege first, I believe, and then we'll easily be able to uh, come up here and crush them. Yeah, we should easily be able to come up here and crush them. Bakhmut is the other siege going on over there somewhere. Come on. 91.2%. 96%. We'll go down to a speed 3 again. Just so I, I will be have, you know, good control when I come to crush this guy, which I'm going to come do here now. They're going to run away. We will get there on the 23rd. They will escape on the 18th like a bunch of bastards. Like a bunch of bastards. So now they're coming here. Now if I come here and stop them, it should stop them. There we go. Now if I come here, I'm guessing I'll get there first, and unless this is a teleporter here, which it is. It's not really a teleporter, but it's the fastest movement, I guess. So we're just we're going around in a giant circle. But this time they shouldn't be able to get away. Yeah, there's no way they're getting away. Manas, I have another son named Manas. I was kind of hoping he... Oh, I should have changed his name. I should have changed his name. But uh, we have another son, yeah. He wasn't a genius, unfortunately. I captured the high chief in battle. Unfortunately, well, it wasn't the uh, king or emperor or whatever. But, uh, 
I have a weak cling on it. Some crappy duchy over here. Oh wow, the Kingdom of Alania has disintegrated. I don't even realize that, um... That, uh, this wasn't considered part of Khazari. Is Khazari a, a de jure title? Kingdom of... Oh, I didn't realize that. So this one should become ours... Soon, right? De jure duchies. There we go. 97. Three more years and that's going to be considered de jure Kazaria. Cool. That is cool. Good to know. Didn't realize that Cumania was uh, not a de jure part of... Uh... Alright, so once again I've done this uh, successful thing where I tried to crash the game. What I was saying was that I didn't realize that uh, Kazaria didn't actually uh, be a de jure didn't have own de jure territory. I should have realized this because I've looked at the kingdoms map mode many times and they don't have lands. So, uh, you know, that's kind of my bad for not paying attention. But yeah, we'll see what happens here. Sir Darya. Another revolt has been uh, declared. Bunch of, of hogwash. None of these revolts are going to in any way affect me. And we're about to win uh, this war anyway. 80% there. Two more to siege. I doubt we'll get 20% from these two sieges. Yeah, 4% from that one. And this one will probably give us... Uh, oh, these are... Because these are both castles. Oh, but he's going to surrender. Beautiful. So our heir and son, Prince Robert the Bruce, can become cruel, which gives plus intrigue, or even become kind, which gives more diplomacy. Um, let's see if he becomes kind. He did not become kind. That's too bad. All right, you want to surrender? Um, they surrender. We accept. Beautiful. First things first is come down here and take care of these guys. Um, now we'll get rid of all of this land. All this precious land going away. Somebody else. Somebody's going to be a very happy camper. Um, I'm a very happy camper though. Just having taken all of this beautiful land. Uh, now he's got to find somebody to give the rest of the land to. Find characters. Men. Uh, who are not rulers who are my religion and my culture um and yeah they need to be adults but that's usually not a problem all right you zebulon you're gonna get um sir daria and then who's next um this guy alp reminds me of alf gizzlecoom and then uh let's see the hunchback, no, the weakling, who's content. Great guy. You're gonna get uh, Otar, Utrar, I think is actually what it was. And let's see, is ooh my god, you, my friend, are gonna become. You're gonna get Chach. Chach. Congratulations, you have gotten Chach. Your ambition is of course no longer valid because you can. You're now impossible to become the rabbi. But so sorry about that. Beautiful, that should fulfill my ambition to gain intrigue. Um, is there any ambitions? Have a daughter. Um, shit, let's do that one. Come on down. And we'll deal with all these goddamn uprisings. So there's one here, there's one here, and there's the one with the 66 Jews running around over there. Where you going? You're going down to here? That's good. Judaism spreading rapidly throughout the world. Nothing like getting Judaism going. Urgench. The Karyite Uprising. What a bunch of bitches, Karyites. I don't have time for goddamn, uh, uh, what do you call your th heresies? That's the word I'm looking for. I don't have time for your goddamn heresies. Just stop being heretics. Get get behind the correct religion, mine. God damn it! You are you're, you're moving surprisingly quickly. Am I gonna get here before you get away? Yes, I am, because this is a teleporter. Awesome. One, one annoying one defeated. You. Offer peace, enforce demands. You have no money, so now you're dead. Beautiful. Sounds like a song, doesn't it? 
Reminds me of the song Suffocation, the game of recreation. I don't know if any of you guys have heard that song. <laughs> I do look it up. It is a horrible, horrible song that children should not be singing, but for whatever reason, we sang it as children. So, uh, yeah, that's a thing. My little son Manas is not like, oh my god. Oh, I don't need to have this chain events going on right now. Um... I gain a national revolt risk of plus one in general opinion. Oh, if he gets suspected demon spawn. So I can roll the dice and get the 50-50 or try to seek the rabbi's help. I'm going to just roll the goddamn dice. Fitty fitty here, guys. Here we go. Did it, did it say what happened? This one. He is a suspected demon spawn. That's not good, and he's gonna start murdering my other kids, probably. And their fucking Tangries have uprisen. I'm gonna have to probably murder my son. The suspected demon spawn one. Or I'll just play with it and make him my next, uh, make him my heir because he'll be so goddamn awesome with his ridiculous stats that, uh, it would be totally worth it. That's the other option. I am on elective succession, so I could always just get my, you know, take one of my other siblings and have them take my lands. Or get my lands. Um, I don't want to go across this river, though. When I, uh, get here. Let's go up to speed four. I don't know why we're walking so slow. God, these huge empires are so hard to, to deal with, with all these men. Um, we'll improve the castle walls there. Um, that guy is not as happy as I would like him to be, whatever, we'll improve the keep there. I think I got everything I want here for now. Eh, I'll get some heavy out cavalry. That's it. That's enough. That's a good good amount of money spent. Uh Yeah, he's got um yeah, this is not good. <laughs> All my people are gonna start dying. Where is his nanny? Her name was Beatrix. Was that not correct? Yes. And she is a suspected witch. Um. So yeah, we're gonna get her murdered. We're gonna just murder the suspected witch. Um, yeah, she's probably gonna die at the banquet. No big surprise there. She's a witch. I'm gonna burn her. Burn her! God, these guys are just going around in circles over here. I gotta go deal with them. Oh, and I'm paused. This is me being stupid. Constantly being stupid right now. It is late at night, guys. I do apologize for my stupidity. Look at the alias thing going on here. Um, uh-oh. No, we like him. Why, 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 why do I want to imprison him? He's part of the plot. I feel like if your plot has 800%, it should just goddamn work. My... God damn it. He, he, this guy keeps telling everybody that I'm trying to murder him. This woman. Is this affecting people's opinion of me? Dishonorable? I don't see a dishonorable penalty. The only person who's probably upset with me is uh, Beatrix. Because, uh, yes, I've tried to murder her twice. Come on, can we just get her killed? Beautiful. So I killed off the witch. That's probably good. Ooh, and I need to look at my heir. He's 12, okay. So I need to watch out for about 970s when I really need to pay attention to what's going on with my heir. Cool. Cool. Um, oh my god. He's gonna be awesome, and then he's gonna get fucking murdered by my other, other child. The demon spawn. It's not appropriate. Oh, they split up. That was uh, probably an ill-advised move for them. I mean, I realize they're two separate revolts. So, uh, I mean, it is what it is, but still. It is what it is. Somebody was really questioning me the other day what the hell that expression means. It is what it is. I think we all know what it is. It is what it is. That's what it is, right? 
Okay, beautiful. One, one, or we're down two of these actually now. Can I uh, banish you? Do you have any money? Nope, I'm gonna execute you instead. Let's look at prisoners. Uh, anybody else to sell or banish? No, there is not. So instead, we're gonna come on down and crush this stupid one because this guy must have inherited these uh, sieges because of, uh, I don't know, shit happens in this game. Oh, I guess this was the original guy, actually. Now I, now I get it. Um, William the Conqueror. And isn't it great that the one guy I gave the, like, normal name to, uh, or the non-normal name to, is the one... The one guy I didn't rename is the one that, uh, became a demon spawn. Gonna probably become Voice of Satan. Alright, second guy taken care of, or third guy taken care of. Um, we're gonna banish you for the 55 gold. And now I can finally come up here and take care of you. you. This guy just running around like a fucking idiot. In fact, I can probably just be like, hey, dude, give me give me your men. And you, give me your men. There we go. 400 dudes. You give me 17 dudes. The reason I want these 17 dudes is just because it's going to give me another flank. What are you, imagine what it must be to be one of these 86 guys. And they're, they're like, the general's like, all right, march west. Okay, march east. Now march north. Okay, now march south. Now march back west. Like, did you, all you can get are these orders that make literally no sense. Ah, oh, they use the fucking teleporter. This is the teleporter, but that's okay. They're, we're gonna, they're gonna get teleported upon. Excellent. Ah, oh, the war's over. Force demands execute you. Yeah, you were, you're a horrible generator general who spent all his time ordering his troops to go around in goddamn circles. Oh, and we got uh, revolts that have crossed in crossed in from our enemies, like a bunch of d bags. So we're gonna take care of them, and then I don't know what I'm gonna do next. I have an important decision though. I can have. I can finally you know celebrate Passover. Let's do that. Maybe uh, everybody will be happy and our demon spawn son won't murder people. Wow. A lot of people refuse my invitation. Why did they refuse my invitation? You like me. Did literally everybody refuse my invitation? Is anybody coming to my Passover Seder? Because that's going to be really lonely. I'm going to be so lonely. Well, everybody's still happy. So, whatever... Do what I want. Declare war. I'm taking taking this guy's lands. I don't think he's got any troops, so uh, I'm coming to get his lands. Yeah, he's got no troops. His lands are going to be mine. They're going to be mine very quickly. High Chief Buzzer the Normal. The Noble, not the Normal. Would have been funnier if it was the Normal. I think in the future I'm going to make a uh, character called somebody the Normal. Good, so we're going to get a nice good war in here real quick. A blitz. My son can become shy or diligent, possibly arbitrary. We're gonna roll a dice here and really hope he becomes diligent. He did. Man, he's becoming a great character. I'm really hoping my other son doesn't murder him. Um, because that would really suck. I could murder my other son. I have plenty of money. Something seriously to consider is murdering him. Uh, I have to think about that. I murdered the witch, so that was good at least. The witch witch. God. I'm really looking forward to this new tribal mechanic that they're going to bring out in Charlemagne. I'm curious what the, how that's going to affect the gameplay. Um, I'm glad you guys all joined the war and brought all your men down, but uh, the war's over. The war is over. Find characters. I need to find a guy to give the land to, and then we're going to end the episode. Um, this guy. Bokan. You're gonna get Baristy. All right, beautiful. So, um, my son becoming the voice of the devil, possibly, was an interesting turn of events. Uh, but otherwise, this episode went pretty well. So, I thank you guys very much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. We're doing very big. I mean, very well. I think uh, we definitely now have the largest uh, font. Uh, I think there's no doubt about that. Yeah, our font is definitely the largest, and that is the only important thing in this game. <laughs> With that all being said, I thank you very much for watching, and I will see you all next time.